Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am with the stars. I'm here to wish each of you a very happy fall equinox and a chance to attain perfect balance in our lives, in our, in our abundance, in our relationships, and in our physical and subtle health. So the very best wishes of this blessed day to each one of you. I was sitting in the park here under an, an oak tree and I just thought I'd tell you I went to touch its bark because there had been a forest fire in, and some while ago and I was wondering how it was doing. And uh, The tree spoke to me as they do sometimes. You know, trees speak very, very quietly, and their thoughts are not like human thoughts at all. They, um, they send the energy in um, waves to us, and somehow there's a being that helps to translate to human thoughts from the energy of the tree, which, which the thoughts are so very different that an intermediary is needed sometimes to, to understand. So I was asking them, and I'll show you. You see the tree, the bark is a little dark, and there are spots on the tree where the bark was burned a little. And, and I was concerned, you know, I wanted to make sure that the, that the tree is doing okay. Now, there are four separate um, big branches here. And so I tried putting my hand on the tree and asking a question. You have to, you have to stand there for a moment or two and they ask, and I asked each one of these trees that are in a row here, I asked each of them how they were doing. And what I heard is this. It was like a man's voice, and they said very, very quietly, or the man said, who was the caretaker of the tree, um, that there had been a fire about five years ago and um, that there was something deep inside that moved up, something deep inside the tree moved up um, and, and nourished the, the tree and not the bark but something deep inside. The voice said, the voice of the man that cared for the tree said that what happens, meaning the fires that happen sometimes in California, do not injure me, do not injure me. And um, I see that, that the leaves are coming out well after, after the fire, and so the trees have the ability to make the leaves with whatever it is that comes up from deep inside. Um, and the roots are safe, the tree says, or the guardian of the tree says. So the roots are safe, and, and the, this part is safe. And so they can, they don't worry too much about the forest fires. That's a feeling I get. Now this word worry is a human word, and it's not a word for trees. So I shouldn't have said it. <laughs> so on with the story. Um, I was standing over here by this tree right here, and I'll show you the view. That's a view of the ocean down there, the Pacific Ocean. And so, I was just standing here, and the tree, uh, like from up above, there's a sunlight too. From up above, I received energy to the right side of my head. It was soft. 
it was soft energy and and it was like a figure eight a little only scrunched a little more together than than an eight and like two spheres of energy only not not too smooth it was a little complicated energy and the energy came in to the right side of my head here from above and then a being translated it and said it's a nice view here and I have to agree the view is absolutely spectacular it's totally beautiful so I started to pack it in and the tree was someone asked the tree how it was was it all right for me to be here and the tree said it's all right a little noisy but all right <laughs> and that's the story for the for the fall equinox 2021 and uh, it's a story about trees and about how they live their lives and how how we might plan to be a little more like a tree a little softer a little quieter a little certain of the outcome even if some unexpected uh, natural event occurs yeah. happy fall equinox everyone take care here comes the breeze wow Thank you.